Hello Libra, my lovely Librans. This is Low Key Magical and I have prepared a space to do your tarot read for mid-May 2022. How are my Librans out there? I know my Libra friends. Let's get started. I have shuffled the cards, divided them into three piles, and I think I'm gonna take the very first pile. Intuition says, let's do that. And we are beginning with the Hierophant. That is a card that represents belief systems and structures and I like to say sometimes corporations. I used to work for a hospital, a Christian-based hospital, and this card always represented them for me. But it can mean, regardless of religion, it can mean you and your own belief systems and those things that have had influence on your life over time that involve structures and belief systems. It can mean higher forms of knowledge, such as college as well. So let's see where this is taking us today, Libra. Wow, the next one is a Knight of Wands. And the Knight of Wands brings some news about work. So, wow, the fact that I was talking about the hospital that I worked for and work shows up. It's gonna be very similar for you. This could be you looking at getting some higher education to start out in a new job. This could be you realizing that you are learning something new about yourself. Maybe your spirituality is beginning to blossom and you are deciding to start out on a new road with new things in mind that will blossom into bigger things for you. This could also be a teaching job that's coming up and Whatever this is, whatever you've been looking at, whatever has been around you that involves that structure and this new opportunity that has come to you, it's going to be very even and balanced for you. This is good. This is a six of pentacles. Pentacles are our earth energy and of course they represent money to a lot of people as well. And this six is a very balanced energy. It's two threes, so we know that threes build upon each other. This man is very satisfied with the balance that he has created here. In fact, he has enough to share with others. This new insight, this new learning, this new degree or this new degree path is leading to new opportunities for you that are going to work out very well on the financial level. In fact, this leads us to a four of pentacles. That's a man who is very stable, male or female, either way. This usually, in the traditional decks, has a pentacle under each foot and a pentacle under each arm. He is stable in that four. He does not move. The thing that we need to look at with this card in negative aspects is someone that's, yes, I've worked really hard for what I have right now and you're not getting any of it. I'm being a little stingy or I'm being a little fearful that this balance might be tipped if I let go of even a single pinnacle. But here we see with the six of pinnacles, there's enough, there's enough to go around. This may have been an energy of the past where you felt like whatever it was that had been in place before, put you in a place where you really did not have anything to spare, nothing. And now you know, because of this choice you made, because of this change in belief system, because of something that felt a little bit bigger than yourself that you have dipped your toe into, some new opportunities have come along. I've got a new way of expressing myself in the world. I've got new work opportunities that are coming up and they're gonna lead me to this safety, to this balance. And a big part of this success is going to be keeping my thoughts in check. Do not let thoughts that you are not good enough, thoughts that things have to be perfect all the time, thoughts that this isn't really the way that I envisioned things when I started out. Don't let those thoughts derail you from what this final goal is. This is, this is a new energy that's coming at you. It's, it's not terribly fast. You need to know that when you're 
starting out on new things that it's gonna it's gonna take some time don't be too hard on yourself the queen of swords again our swords represent our thoughts can be an energy of i have good control of my thoughts i know exactly what i want but it can also be a card of harsh words and dissatisfaction and to me this is more of an internal dialogue don't let this negative internal dialogue cut down what you have been working to grow and put together i mean look at the look at the growth that's around him here look at what he tromping through the bushes like he's having to he's having to blaze some trails that are kind of new when you're blazing those trails don't get too hard on yourself because everything's going to come out okay with the six of pentacles you are building stability the six of pentacles it's not the 10 it's not over this is a process the six of pentacles is building wealth and that's where you're headed have confidence in yourself have confidence in these changes that you've made and don't be afraid of what you felt before that i have no wiggle room you do you absolutely do and don't let these thoughts of oh no this isn't working out the way i want no 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 turn that around I am confident in myself. I know I'm going in the right direction because I'm keeping my goal firmly in mind. Excellent. Well, thank you so much, Libra. This is fantastic. You have a great day.